your oysters are underwater. Day 39, let's see what he's up to at this hour. Oh, it's a barrel. Good morning. <laughs> With a paper stacked up his snoot. It's literally toilet paper. So it's morning and I don't know what he's up to. He's probably making a cup of coffee or something. Aren't you? Coffee. Coffee. <laughs> I thought so. There's a couple of cups, a uh, couple of teaspoons of sugar. <laughs> You? <laughs> I was literally freezing this morning. <laughs> Beat that. <laughs> I was freezing this morning. Beat that. <laughs> I guess it's a uh, next day here. It's obviously Sunday today, I think. <laughs> and the sun's starting to rise too. Already. Yeah, already. <laughs> of course it is. Since we're further south and we're further east. The sun, well, well, that's a good reason why. We're in Russell Island now. This isn't Caramine Beach. So the sun will rise up earlier. I found out that when I moved here in 2015, when I moved to Brisbane. I found out. Well, sometimes the sun rises at five in the morning. Cable tie in there. Okay, there we go. Cable ties in there. Ugh. The sun's starting to rise and look. Red remnants left on the railing again. See? Right there. Dregs. <sighs> Dregs. You yeah, have a look at this islanders. Look. Red. Remnants on the railing. In all honesty, really? Really, buddies? Really? Yes, it was nearly dark when I put that there. There was one lone birdie. One lonely birdie. He had a bit... Grabbed a beak full and flew off. And yep, and there's more bread there too. And it got dark. Oh, yeah. And look, there's a piece of bread still there. So it's still there. It's still there. And only one cook came to dinner. Oh, yeah. Which was weird. The other one was sitting up on the power pile up there. Up on the power line and didn't even come down to dinner. Down. That's ridiculous. It was up there and didn't even come down to dinner. Really? So really, the cook of I would just rather be a spectator. He'd rather be, rather be a spectator than a participant. Really? <laughs> 
Yeah, you might be right. Might not have been hungry. But yeah, you might be right. Might not have been hungry. But sometimes, sometimes birds aren't that hungry. <laughs> That's why some of them just rather be a spectator, right, Islanders? Yeah. They just... They'd all rather be a spectator than a participant. Oh yeah, the sun's rising, so... Like, if you see out there, the sun's starting to rise. He's awake, the cooker. <laughs> oh yeah. Over there. Laughing because the dawn has come. It's because it's dawn now, and when it's sun, when the sun's rising, the cook burrows are up. Usually they're up by sunrise, and I'm going to go back to my bed because I'm not supposed to be out here being a bit naughty, flouting the rules. Because I have a bit of a cold. Alrighty, it is later on in the day. Hi. It's me to start on the dinner. Yep. <laughs> And I'm going to show you all outside here. So, yes, yeah, so all you islanders see, it's such a gloomy, cloudy day. Oh, well, who do we have here? Take a look at this. Our resident curlews are here. Someone is waiting for his dinner. Our resident curlews are here. Our resident curlews are here. This is looking interesting already. These are our resident curlews. And these are definitely our resident curlews here. And they're our resident curlews because they live over there. Right near the mailbox, that's where they live. They live right under that tree there. That's why they're our resident curlews, because they live here. During the day, they're usually gone. But in the late afternoon, they arrive here. So that's why that that's just a taxi, don't worry about it. So makes the cab going down another street. Oh, look at how Curlew's eating the bread already. <laughs> oh, one of them is swiftly speeding. And that one. Where are they going? Good question. Yeah. Wherever it is, it's at 100 miles an hour. Yeah, let me have a look. They're not here. They must be out of the house or something. I'm going to take a look. Where are you birdies? Curlews! 
curlews. They're not there. Are they here, everyone? I don't see them anywhere. Oh well. At least got to see the curlews before they before the before they raced away. That's what you call doing a runner. <laughs> yeah, that is exactly right. That is what we call doing a runner. Running. Running at a fast speed. Then it's so impossible to keep up. Now that is cool doing a runner. I agree. And it's all getting gloomy and overcasted, Sam. And gonna rain again. Uh, it all, yeah, it rains, but it doesn't rain as much as Caramine Beach does. In Caramine Beach, it rains all the time. Sometimes non-stop. We've had quite a last, we've had a sunny day yesterday, I think. Mm. And it was a little bit sunny this morning as well. But of course, it was it got overcast um, this afternoon, and it is overcast right now. There's the eagle up in the tree. Oh yeah, the eagle up there. Right up there. Yeah. <sighs> you won't see him. Yeah, I don't. Right in behind that furry cluster there. See that branch going out to the right? There's a lot of branches going out to the right. Pretty high up. Branch going to the right, and that cluster of leaves on the end of it. You can be behind that cluster of leaves. Oh, over there. Uh. He's probably got a nest there. Oh, well, there you go. At least we found out. <laughs> I turned that dinner on, didn't I? Yeah. yeah let, me, let me check just to confirm. Yes. Yes, she did. Get the duck. What duck? I'm hearing tapping. I'm hearing tapping. It was a tap, 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 tap. I'm hearing it again. Probably next door again. <laughs> I'm hearing tap, 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 and it's probably next door. Right. I'm hearing tap, 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 and it's probably coming from next door. Yeah. Oh yeah, okay. I'll actually get on with the washing, I've got a few.